Last time, we showed you paradise. Today, we show you glory. The glory of a hockey life well lived. One thousand pro games. It's one of the biggest hockey milestones a player can achieve. In the minors, it takes a lot of long bus rides, a lot of soggy subs, and a lot of, eh, let's just say, interesting hotel rooms. Not every 1,000 games makes the front of the sports pages or the six o'clock news. One of the great people I've met through my time in this game is this man from a small town called Seaforth. Derek Nesbitt. In the game of hockey, to make it this far, it isn't easy. In fact, to make it this far, you have to be a gladiator. Derek played in his 1,000th game on December 22nd, 2021 in Jacksonville, Florida. Unfortunately, to not a ton of fanfare, and they lost in a shootout. He deserved a bigger celebration than he got. So, he decided to throw him one. What's up, boy? Oh, is this... Hey! How you doing, buddy? Good. Good to see you, Val. You too. You too. Fuck, I don't miss the back to backs. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't even realize you guys played last night. And you're like, I'm taking my option. I was like, buddy. oh shit. Oh, buddy. yeah. Groin hanging you know, on by three, a thread. That's yeah, okay. It's okay. Good. Yeah, I thought I was going to have to come and give you a rub. No, I'll take one. I'll take one. <laughs> Anyone's willing to rub me down, I'm down. That's a, What's up? I'll say hi to all the boys. What's up, yeah, man? Matt, Paul, Paul nice great to meet you, boys. Yeah. Paul, man. Great to meet you. Yeah, yeah. What's up, buddy? Good to meet you. Yeah, great little setup for you guys here. Yeah, could I take a peek at the ice? I haven't yeah, even seen the, the barn yet. Yeah. So is this where Gwinnett always played? Like yeah, that's what, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, Holy hey, jumping! Hey, hey, yeah, we didn't have any guys that jacked when I played. <laughs> What's up, buddy? How you doing, brother? Hey, he's, gonna have the, he's gonna have the titties popping on camera. Titties popping for the ladies. A <laughs> couple more gram followers for the boys. <laughs> How you feeling? Good. You excited? Yeah. A little yeah. nervous? Not a little, but it's a little nervous. Big, it's going to be a big night. Oh, That's what a true. barn. Yeah. Oh, I thought I almost, I thought I was going to chew on one there. What's up, boys? A little pregame, get the legs going. <laughs> hey, we'll see you guys tonight. Good luck. It was great to meet some of the guys, and Derek was even nice enough to include me in his pregame routine. Orlando had state-of-the-art facilities and a dialed-in food program. For Derek, Chipotle does the trick. Fucking in and out. They must know this guy here. H hockey legend. Hopefully this has a few in me tonight. We were heading to Derek's house. He had some family come in. Most notably, his parents, who he hadn't seen for over a year due to the pandemic and whose names could be in the pages of a Dr. Seuss book. All right, come on in, guys. Graham and Pam. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys make of the fact that he played a thousand pro games? Amazing that he played a thousand games. I remember a woman I worked with, her son played near the end of his season, he was playing in the American Hockey League and played a game against Derek. And he came back and said to his mom, that kid must love hockey because he says, I couldn't be on a bus like that all the time. He said, we had it too good playing. It, I never thought about it until she said that, like what he went through in American Hockey League and, and the East Coast League all the time. Like, it's not easy. It's not easy to do that. Being from the South is all football and baseball in our family. Meeting Derek and starting and going to the games and stuff, it was opening me and my family up to a new experience altogether. And then we just like all became like fans of him, which is kind of weird, but also really like, holy crap, like this is, this is really neat. And, and marrying him, you know, I mean, he's just, Outside of hockey, he is a wonderful, wonderful man. He is passionate about anything and everything that he does. Yeah, it's, it's been a fun ride, for sure. Whitney's right, but this journey started a long time ago. 
Derek's been mucking it up since the early 90s. I was working in Glencoe at the Glencoe Arena when we were first married and when Derek was born. And of course, I had to put a pair of skates on him and had him on the ice before his first birthday. That didn't exactly go as expected. <laughs> but before long, he wanted to be pushing the little push cart around by himself. He didn't want help from mom and dad. Oh, what's up? Get on, oh, you saw the camera on him. Come here. Oh, is he nervous? Give me hugs. You have fun at school? Oh. You have a good day. Were you a good boy? Yeah. Yeah, what'd you do? I played. You played. You want you me want to, to play <laughs> goalie? Okay, buddy. I'm not going to let any soft ones in, though. Do you want me I'm to not, put the I'm net out here? I'm not playing tummy sticks if we're playing. <laughs> hey, let me ask you a question. Do you know how many games your dad has played in pro hockey? Yeah. How many? Two. <laughs> <laughs> You're close. Yeah. <laughs> you were close. Whoa. Say, what's up, what's up, guys? Is this all you've been waiting to get home from school for, is to play, to play hockey? Oh, oh, good save by me. Oh, ow, my go. toe. <laughs> ow, it's a real puck. <laughs> <laughs> good job, Scores. buddy. Good job. What do you do when you score? Goal. And then what? Huggies. Goal huggies. Yep. Oh, Come huggies? Goal hugs. Yep. I, used to ride, I used to do the ride the stick. <laughs> Can you do that? Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> he said that you, you, you've been Bond scrapping a little bit. You've been shedding the mitts too. Yeah, drop your gloves. Drop your gloves with Biz. <laughs> kind of like you're that. You're drop them? There, yeah, you go. there you go. That's how it starts. That's when there you're, you go. you're mucking it up in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> well, buddy, it was a pleasure playing hockey with you. We're going to have a fun night, and I hope you get to get on the ice with us when we do our, our little celebration for your dad's uh, two games that he's played in pro. <laughs> The more things change, the more they stay the same. Gladiators coach Jeff Pyle has known Derek since the beginning. I know Derek because I coached him, recruited him, coached him, and then uh, traded him one time, got him back the next year, and uh, we've kind of been the same paths have crossed throughout our careers. I mean, he was my my first pro game. Regular season game was worse for was for Piler. It's a pretty cool story, I guess. You don't, I don't know how many guys. I know a lot of guys have played a thousand games, and it, I don't know how many have played their first and thousandth with the same coach and and with the same team, where it all comes kind of back full circle. Boys, we talked about uh, from day one. We've talked about creating a moment. Everything we've done this year has been pretty special. Everybody stepped up, watching us develop. We talk about it. Tonight's another night, Derek Nesbitt weekends. We're all here for you, Nezzy. I just want everybody to go out and have some fun. We give them nothing, no Hail Marys. They're gonna have to earn everything. You defend, you work your ass off, you go after the two points, we have a good start, and we go from there. Be kicking, Joe, let's go. In goal, Joe Murdaka. On defense, Tim Davison. Derek Topadage. Cam Neely. Sorry. I swear, can we re reverse that one? <laughs> Cam Kiley on right wing, Eric Neely. And the man of the hour, Derek Nesbitt. Boys, short and hard, let's have some fun. Here we go. Fucking Cam Neely's back? Holy shit, fucking, where's Cam Neely? Uh, I heard rookie party tomorrow. We got a TNT gig here. And maybe I'll double it if you guys pull off the win, okay? Fucking let's go for Nesbitt, boys. Let's fucking go! Camille, you're starting. <laughs> Some important people in Derek's life who couldn't make it 
want to deliver a message. Hey guys, it's Snoo Karate here. Just want to congratulate you on a thousand pro games, man. That's uh, something super special. You know, you make our hometown proud. Um, congratulations to your family as well. It's a huge accomplishment. Just want to say I hope you guys are doing well. Um, look forward to seeing you soon, man. Hey Nezzy, just want to say congratulations on a thousand games. It was a pleasure getting a chance to play with you in Peoria back in the day. A thousand games is a great milestone. Uh, it just shows your dedication to the game, your craft. It's something very special. Congratulations, buddy. Hey Nezzy. All I want to say is congratulations, man. A thousand games. You're a true teammate, leader, captain, and everything else. We even got him a silver stick. We also had renowned artist David Arrigo paint one of his game-worn jerseys. That, that was the most expensive one ever because we had to put all these teams on it. <laughs> Let's hear it for Derek! Let's go! Let's fucking go! We didn't do this for Derek Nesbitt, the hockey player. We did it for Derek Nesbitt, the person. When this league was in trouble and COVID happened, he stepped up and helped out. This guy is a salt of the earth guy. To Graham and Pat in the box up top, his parents, Thank you for conceiving this young, amazing individual, and let's hear it for Derek, let's go! Uh, I'm gonna be quick so we can get the puck on the ice here, but uh, uh, this, it's pretty overwhelming. Uh, ever since Biz threw out that first uh, post on social media back in December 22nd, it's, it's been uh, a bit of a whirlwind waiting for this, and, and it's been very exciting. Hopefully give you a great game, and, and thanks to everyone here, I know um, he mentioned the youth hockey. Obviously, I see a lot of the Atlanta Phoenix and Georgia United jerseys. I appreciate all you guys. Uh, obviously, my, my parents drove down last Friday. They haven't, because of the world we're living in, they haven't got to see this guy since he was five months old. So it's been a pretty special week for us as well. And then uh, my wife, I love you. Thank you to thank my wife right there, with her right there, and with me holding my son. There's nothing better than that. In fitting fashion, he decided to let the next generation kick things off. It's your turn. We need to hear you say, let's play hockey. Let's play hockey. There we go. Thank you, guys. It just makes me so proud as a wife and the mother of his child that he is so committed to doing what he loves the most, and that's hockey. And for him to want to do it for as long so that Declan can be in the stands and watch him play. That's on the power play up 2 nothing here in the second. Nesbitt. Down to the corner and trading places with Sylvester. He shoots and scores! Number two! Soon-to-be-father Cody Sylvester, and it's 3-0 Atlanta. We've had a lot of really cool things happen this year with our team. We've got three guys about to be fathers. A lot of cool milestones by myself, uh, Mike Pellick, who an anchor for our team who we just lost for the season. He's hit some really cool milestones in this league. He's, he's surefire Hall of, ECHL Hall of Famer. We bring a kid over who's lighting it up that we got from, from South Korea. All the young kids who have just blossomed, guys we didn't know may be here, now they're turning into such impact players for us. Guys in the lineup, different goalies, losing some, and then guys just stepping up. And I see there's such an unbelievable story till now, and we just need an ending. Well, that's a man down, just 15 seconds left here in the third. There's a five-car pileup behind Joe Murdaka. It comes out wide, that's Housinger, his shot gets blocked at the empty net. Nets there he goes, baby! To get this win, I think, means more than getting the win on the thousands. 
because of everything behind it. And the way it happened, call it hockey gods, whatever it is, um, it was such a friggin' cool day, man. It was awesome.